this video, I'm going to get out for a little fishing in Florida. It's my seventh year coming down here. I'm going to get out for three or four days for a little while. I'm going to try some surf fishing for Pompano, some pier fishing, maybe get some flounder. I'm going to try some bridge fishing and in intercoastal. Hopefully get a few fish this week. Give it a shot. Fishing the Flagler Pier. See if we get a big drum or some flounder. Today, fishing live shrimp on a slip sinker rig. See if we can pick up a few flounder today. That's what I'm using for bait here. Live shrimp. Manatees. Yeah, manatees. Shark. Land shark. Flounder. That's a nice flounder there. Look at the pole. Look at the rock there. It's a hard fighting fish. Small fish. It's a medium one. I got one. Look down the water. Big flounder. Yep. Yep. You got him on there? Huh? I think so. I don't know if I'm getting them up. <laughs> There's nobody got a net out here now. I might try to pull them up by hand. We're on a hand pull, ready? Nice flounder. You got him under good? Second flounder. I just lost a monster fish. Had to be well over 100 pounds fighting him. 
hugging the bottom. We finally went under a pier, got wrapped around one of the posts. Had him on for about 10 minutes, I couldn't even budge him. I got 50 pound test line and a heavy duty pull, I couldn't budge him. Right after that, I got this flounder. Well, so far I got two nice keeper flounders. Whiting, a grunt, a uh, little shark. And I just had a massive, massive fish. Had to be 100 pounds. Couldn't lift them off the bottom using 50 pound test, a heavy duty rod. I couldn't bring him up. After about 10 minutes, he ran underneath the pier, got tangled around the, the, po the wood posts. And earlier, I had a fish almost took my line in the water. I go to grab the grab the rod, and it's taken off like a freight train. The one went to grab the rod from going in the water, grabbed the line and the rod, and the rod almost snapped in half, and it broke the 30 pound test fluorocarbon leader. Man, two big, huge fish I had on. One, I, one was probably a giant, giant stingray or something. The other one could have been a giant drum or something, you know. I'll give it a little longer. Had a few fish. Oh man, this lost another monster, monster fish. The other one was slow hugging the bottom. This one took off like a freight train, ran about 50 yards down the pier, ran out, ran around. Got him near the pier, didn't get a look at him. Then he decides to run underneath the pier. I couldn't even stop him. I put the brakes on him, I couldn't even stop him. And got underneath, wrapped around the pilings again. Big fish, that's three. Three monsters I had hooked today. I got 50 pound test and a heavy rod and I couldn't even slow these down. Now I've caught 30 pound salmon, it didn't fight as hard, hard as these. These fish were huge, man. Oh, man. Size of that catfish. That's a monster catfish. Catfish and gravy, man. <laughs> cat on top of rice. That's a big sail cat there. This yeah, guy here has caught it. Call it a day. Came out for the afternoon bite. Had three monster fish. They got me tangled up and broke off. A couple flounders. Got three flounders, some croakers, and a little shark. <laughs> all in all, it was a good time. Time to go. Maybe next year I'll be able to get them big fish. There's a the river. Give it a try. Well, heading back out. Do a little fishing. Second night at the Halifax River. I'm going to try the Main Street Bridge. Was out there last night. Got a redfish, a couple trout, maybe 15 ladyfish, and one jack. Kind of windy. Hopefully it's a little better tonight. We'll give the river a try, Halifax River. We're using live shrimp, We're using live shrimp under a slip bobber. Got a live shrimp.
shrimp. Fish one under a slip hopper. Bobber drift with that live shrimp. Get me fishing. Get him. What is that? So heavy. Flounder. What's that one about? 18, 20 inches? Huh? Yep. Flounder. Nice, decent one. Beautiful night out here, out on the Main Street Bridge. Another good trout, man. That's a keeper size trout. About maybe 16 and a half inches. Trout. Now we tried it for a couple hours again on Halifax River. Night fishing with live shrimp under a float. A couple hours out here, got a nice flounder. It's about a 16 and a half inch trout and a bunch of ladyfish. Last night I got a redfish, a couple trout. And I uh, had two big, hook, huge snook hooked. They took off like a freight train, jumped and spit the hook on me twice. Caught me 15 ladyfish last night, too. It was fun, but hopefully next year we'll get, get a big snook. All right, let's get out. Little pompano. Get started. 
first crash took about a minute to get a bike. Stop by that one, there it goes. That one's 13 to the fork. That's 12 inches there and another inch to go. Baby. Well, today I'm at Flagler Beach, just about high tide, getting a little late start today. Yesterday we spent the day trying different beaches to see if we could locate some Pompano. Tried Marineland, Florida, Flagler Beach, and finally we found some. So we're back, give it a try, set up two rods. Fishing clams, salted clams on a pompano rig. Hopefully we get a few fish. Something biting that one. Here it goes. Fish on. Just started off five minutes into it. Doesn't feel very thick. We were getting into some pompanos yesterday. Got two keepers. What is that? Whiting. Start off the day with a whiting. Dolphins out there chasing my fish away. There's the dolphin, see him? Another pompano, too small. We're probably about two or three miles north of Flagler Pier all over there. You got a potato chip. He got him potato chip too. Can't fit it down his hole. There he goes. You got another potato chip. Another little 
stinky baby one. Dude, I got the honey hole for popping them, but they're all babies. That dude down there was fighting a fish for about 15 minutes. Main Street Pier in Daytona. Oh, yeah. Sea turtle. Hello, sea turtle. Shark. Stopped at Krabby Joe's here on the Sun Glow Pier. Had a nice meal here. Didn't fish today. Let the guys out there be getting some nice sharks. Got a nine foot hammerhead, seven foot black tip, and a few other nice ones. Other than that, no flounder here. Just some whiting and blue fish. Somebody here waiting to get some fish. Yeah. I've been getting a lot of sharks at this pier this week. I'm saying shark week. 